Hi dear souls. So I thought I'd share uh, a few words on collecting energy. Everything has its own signature, its own method of collecting energy. I just walked past um, various beach flora and fauna on my way to the field and this is what inspired me to talk about this because um, we had heavy rainfall and thunder and lightning last night and when watering the garden we're always told to water the soil but in reality often the soil is covered and so the water goes on the leaves and water is literally liquid light and um, each plant knows exactly how to collect it so that it nourishes itself and if you look at the leaves on the plants and the way that they hold out their their hands they're literally their hands and say please nourish me um, you'll see how that water um, is distributed uh, to its roots beneath in the soil so I was thinking about this so we have the plants and we have the trees and we have the animals and the humans and the birds and the natural kingdoms and then you also have uh, those things those things those spaces those spaces that also uh, collect and accumulate energy in those areas where it becomes stagnant so where there is not flow energy will pocket and it will stagnate so this is a really um, useful exercise and that is to go out in nature and feel um, the flow and the movement of the energy that surrounds you in open spaces and then go somewhere where it's more enclosed like you know the side of a car park or something and just look at the plants there and the energy there feel it close your eyes feel it into your body and then go into your house and just walk around and go into the corners of your house as well and just feel there often in corners we place a load of stuff um, because you know most people's houses are limited of space or at least with whatever space people have they tend to fill it up and that's not how we're supposed to use space we're supposed to allow space to hold space so that the energy flows more and when there's too much stuff in a space the energy doesn't always circulate in the way that um, is beneficial to us so go into your homes and just walk around or visually look into every space and put your hand over your heart and just feel whether there's any stuck energy there and whether that you can release it because um, this will be useful as a useful prep to the lead up to solstice so that you're really prepared to welcome in the fresh energies and um, amplify them and collect them with your own signature of collection and your own signature of collection um, can get a little bit distorted through living on the earth plane where there's all this material stuff and we think oh I must have this I must have that and then as each time we take something in we don't always release and let go and that's the same with our thoughts and our feelings as we take things in we don't always let go of stuff in the past which is why a lot of people hold on to their limitations and their outdated beliefs it's all energy everything is energy so take a step inside have a look around is there anything that you can release and let go of you know this is an exercise that needs to be done on a weekly basis it's not something to do just at springtime this is to be done throughout the year um, it's very helpful you know when something comes in let something out release it release it let it go somewhere where it is needed so many people sit on loads of stuff and they don't even use it and then when they finally give it up to a charity shop it's of no use to anyone because it's so outdated no one wants to wear it or it smells like moths or you know 
it's just nice for energy just keep things flowing keep things moving and with yourself as well you know for instance dream time is incredibly revealing you collect energy in dream time and you release energy in dream time so what are your dream times revealing and telling you and um, what is your waking hour revealing and telling you where do you need to release and let go what messages are you receiving and just remember you have your own signature of collecting energy and you can amplify it or you can let it stagnate by not doing your inner housework so just a little share god bless you all have a beautiful joyful and peaceful day